Hi, welcome to Realtor Recon. My name is Jay McMakin, Director of Veteran Affairs for Ross Mortgage Corporation. What we're gonna to discuss today is VA rental income. Now, under the rental income category in the VA pamphlet, there's several different sections, and that can go from multi-unit properties to single-family residents. The first one we're gonna talk about today is single-family residents, where a veteran used to occupy this particular property. So I'm a veteran, I own a home right now, I'm gonna lease this property out and go purchase another one. That's the scenario that we're covering. When I do that, all I have to do is obtain a lease agreement with my potential uh, renters in there, and then I can use 100% of that income on the lease agreement and offset my mortgage payment. So the income that comes from that offsets the mortgage payment. Now if there's a surplus, so let's say my payment is a thousand dollars okay but on my lease agreement I have 1300 they're not going to give me 300 right all we're going to do is just offset and wash the payment of a thousand dollars that's what that means so I can't take the extra three hundred dollars and use that as effective income in my PITI now if I don't have a lease agreement I can still do this however I cannot use a hundred percent of the income I'm only going to use 75% of whatever's on the lease agreement, but that's also, I have to prove, and, and the proof is on me, that this is a strong rental market, and we'll do that through the rent schedules of the appraisal. This is the section for single family residents. When you have a, a rental income for the veteran who previously occupied their home, my name is Jay McMakin, Director of Veteran Affairs. Thanks for listening to Realtor Recon.